Okay guys, spring is about to sprung and I have got the best and when I tell you I say I've got the best styles and looks for the transitional season in the head, you're gonna wanna watch this video. Hello there guys! I'm wishing the spring would have sprung because it is wet outside but your girl has got a new colour change, she's a blondie because I need to bring the brightness here. This is the first time in such a long time I've sat down and I want to show you the items that I've got from lots of different brands. We've got the high end, we've got the high street, we've got shoes, we've got accessories, we've got coats. Girls, I have you and it feels so good. I can't lie, I've really come back into like feeling what I want to look like and presenting myself as the woman that I want to be. So some of that means having a wardrobe that is together. Like I don't do this playing around with what am I going to wear? We're not doing that anymore. But I want to share with you all the goodies that I've got from a variety of different brands. So let's roll. Ah! We are going to slay the house in this red number. And this is the definition of trend dressing, but trend dressing in the way that works for you. Red is on trend, mesh is on trend, and I'm not necessarily gonna say that a suit is on trend when there's a suit not on trend, but fundamentally, I love a good like suit situation, but I'm wearing it in kind of the color that is of the season in a way that works for me. This is from Zara and I love it. It's an all red dramatic look. Would you look in dramatic? I am in love with this. I feel very much like put together, but also really fun. I know it's strong, but you don't have to wear all the pieces all together. You could wear a red blazer, white t-shirt, blue jeans, or you could wear white trousers and this, and mix it up in the way that works for you. But I love this. The shirt, the whole look is from Zara. I'm not wearing a bra underneath because she's living dangerously to the wind. But here's what this looks like. And I've got this with this new coach bag that I have. This is one of the best new affordable bags out there. And I just think that this is a look. Like, here we have this jacket from Zara. Just look at the cut of it. Look at the shape and I love it. And the jeans are also Zara. They're a more lower rider, but they cut off quite low at the ankle. Uh, step back so you can see. This look is just so new york i'm off to new york and then i also have these new ysl glasses like ah oh, i'll just wear this with a pair of trainers or my prada boot but like it just looks so good and it looks so high-end like i'm shot it's the shape of the jacket which is super copperani as in wow the jeans no stretch got them in a size 10 still a bit of a struggle still open here but I am now in love with the concept of a tailor for whenever I need them. This is so me. If you ever wanted to know what my style is, this is it. This is a bit more like older school style, but I feel like if you want to stay warm, it's a good choice. I just have this like basic top. I know it's a basic look, a white top, top and jeans, but it always eats, you know, it always like hits. And this is very much an everyday, but I wanted to show you this jacket on top. This is a kind of off-brown vintage style bomber jacket. I specifically have been looking for bomber jackets. I really wanted an oversized bomber jacket, but this one's actually shorter than I thought and I got it in a medium. So I think it's meant to even be like a cropped. I think I would love it in a large, but I still like it how it looks. I just think that this looks really, really good. Like I'm in love. And I also have these new Loewe glasses, slightly different shape. So these glasses are the new shape, they're from the newer collection. And I just think they're so fun. Loewe in general hits so much and this just goes right with it. Moving on from Zara, I don't even wanna tell you about this brand because they make such quality items, it's insane. But I'm gonna tell you, and that brand is called Pixie Market. I have this gorgeous cropped jacket situation. Love, love, love. I probably wouldn't wear these two denims together, but I love the kind of complete denim looks. Very much 2000s and I'm here for it. This is what this looks like. Pow, pow. Just love it. It's such a fun little bolero style jacket. I've not used the word bolero in so long, but yes, it's a bolero. This top 
these trousers I needed to show you. So this top, I actually bought it last year, if not the year before last from the same company in the black. Absolutely loved it, wore it all the time. It's amazing quality, but it's been eaten by the wardrobe monster. Can't find that top anywhere but it's such good quality and this is when i say i really like something i not only did i buy it in white i bought the black version again and i'm very annoyed that i'm buying a top i already have but i had to buy it again because it's just such good quality you can wear with absolutely everything it's really heavy duty really warm and i have this new thing now about me wearing basically like white and light colors more often because it makes you look a bit more put together and posh and you know white is for posh people let's not lie but i'm not gonna lie because when you are ghetto fabulous like you need to stay in dark colors because that mcdonald's meal that you ate on the bus which i've done is going to be streaming down your white shirt but i'm trying to change as a human being which is why i'm we wearing white a lot more often so i can look after it the linen trousers are also from zara a really good quality material really nice and really thick again i'm really into like an oversized trouser with an oversized coat so here's this jacket that kind of goes with my look which is all about lights and whites and creams this i bought on sale it's from magda butram and unfortunately it is a size 10 which i think is a little bit too big for me but there's no other sizes anywhere in the world your girl's gonna keep it and she's gonna get it tailored the shoulders are shouldering oh i just love a jacket like this don't just don't just leave me alone ah, come on i'm sorry i'm in my 80s auntie era there are shoulder pads in it you can love shoulder pads you can hate shoulder pads it's really a personal preference and shoulder pads can always be taken out but i just love the way it looks just the whole thing together as you can see i'm just really getting into my upping my style era where's the business at ah, ah, you thought i was feeling you what can we talk about the boobs can we get into the titties i told you lot that i didn't want to tell you about pixie market but here is pixie market with its high quality great styles basics but elevated now i know this is almost like a kind of take on the rico wind but i don't have 900 pounds so i'm not gonna lie i don't have 900 pounds to spend on a little black dress thank you pixie market this dress is just perfection i'm gonna show these shoes these are ferragamo if you guys don't know you might need to follow me on tiktok i have shared about my amazing experience at the ferragamo store so i want to show you the shoes the other outfits i have on like instagram and tiktok but i haven't really focused on the shoes that are just such an amazing fun cool style and it's super iconic it's like a new design which was like oh phenomenal so good i bought it twice this is the top from pixie market i could only get it in a medium which is a little bit big for me i just thought yes i need the dress but i also need the top hold on hold on i'm so much more thoughtful about each item i have why i have them and what styles kind of suit me like now as i get into my mid 30s i want to look i know i get a baby face but i want to look like like a grown sexy put together woman and these are the alaya shoes i've seen these everywhere I've seen them in the black i've seen them in the red and i was like i want to get my own pair i feel like i could have these in every single color so i decided to pick these up in the nude why i love them is that they are a mule oh my god for girls with big feet like me a mule is so flattering these i feel like they're going to shorten my feet but also be super flattering and i think it will go lovely with this outfit what is going on so the medium of the top it fits me it's nice but i do have to pull it up i might just like stitch it again we talked about this we can see a tailor to make sure i get the most perfect fit but overall it's just so flawless i have to show you these trousers from loewe last year i showed you the trousers that kim k copied off of me no i'm joking <laughs> but i did show you the attico jeans and the trend everywhere is going to be more and more cargo pants and i saw these ones in loewe and they were the most gorgeous shape 
and the way that they fit me way better than the Attico trousers and they're also not in a kind of what's the word they're not in a cargo style it's like a gorgeous dark denim with a beautiful brown stitching so this is like an everyday trouser and it looks so sick it's got like the drop crotch and everything I'm ob obsessed with mean, my whole glasses on the wave I've, I've fallen in love with them i think that they're really interesting really fun like just have a look at the jeans look at the pocket detail look at the back look at everything and they're so so comfortable it's insane yes it's another la number how gorgeous though it fits like a dream it's like a double mesh the body is bodying in this the fit is phenomenal and obviously it's in the season's red but I just feel like it's such a great dress I'm in love I'm in love 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 like it's such good quality as well and I picked up the small what I will say about Lueve they're smart their sizing's a little bit weird like I think it comes up bigger than normal so I can wear a small and also an extra small I feel like this is the dress that I can wear summer spring next year party dress down dress up anywhere it's just an anywhere kind of dress which is my favorite kind of dress i'm giving you avocado it's a green meal situation this is from pretty lavish i've shopped on pretty lavish like three times now the quality is out of this world on there for the item especially for the price pretty lavish has got some really nice knit materials and i wanted to get some kind of bright colored like dresses like this it's like off the shoulder <laughs> i've not worn off the shoulder for so long i feel like it's gonna make a comeback though so i really do like the style of this and i don't mind this kind of I'm gonna call it sickly green. I can't lie, it's a bit of a sickly green, but I don't mind it because I didn't spend too much on it. And I can see me wearing this little green dress for like a brunch or something. And yeah, it's cute, no? No, I love it. Look at these shoes, guys. I just need you to see these shoes from St. Laurent. I hope that you're getting the beauty of the blue on this because it's so insane and cobalt blue is a color that is gonna be hot for the season ahead and to be fair i don't have enough blue stuff and i definitely don't have any blue shoes and the contrast color for blue is actually orange and i have a lot of orange and i love orange so i was like you know what i'm gonna get these and in person they look absolutely fire and then this set here is also from pretty lavish i have another pair of heels if Cinderella was a stripper in 2023, she'd be wearing these. Or she was Patricia Bright and she's wearing these. I had a long horror story with these shoes, but we made that out on the other end. The team reached out, sent me a new pair. Almost broke my neck in these, but we have a new pair. So here we go. Finally, a new pair of casual shoes. I haven't bought anything like this for such a long time, but I've fallen in love with the comfort of New Balance. So these have been added to the collection and they go with absolutely everything. Okay guys, I think that is it. Those are so many of my spring transitional items. I think some are quite warm, there's lots of coats, but there's a few bright pops of colors, stuff that's a little bit skin showing, but that can also be worn in summer. This is how I'm gonna shop from now on. Like, There's gonna be quite a few bits, but they're gonna be looks that are gonna be wearable. And throughout the month, I'll probably show you how I bring them together and do some other chats. I'll have all links in the description bar below for anybody looking for those items. I shop for, the, for all of us, okay? I've got you guys. Um, if there's anything else you wanna see, let me know, but you can catch me on Instagram, TikTok, and definitely not on Twitter. That is the pit. <laughs> anyway guys, thank you for watching and I will see you all later.